there's so many games that come to mind. The Raiders game, the Super Bowl, the NFC Championship game at Lambeau Field. What immediately comes to your mind of his performances? I think the singular performance, the top of that list that you mentioned, Lance, is the Oakland game. Because what a personal circumstance. His dad just died. And he could do anything he wanted. Mike Sherman told him, hey, go home, whatever, whatever you want to do. But he addressed the team, told him he's going to play. And it was kind of remarkable, the actual game itself. Brett was outstanding, no question about it. But the rest of the team watching their response to his trouble, his hardship, I think that whole team elevated their game because of Brett Favre and how much they thought of him and really how much they loved him. Final thing, Larry, is I know how much you love football. I know how much you love calling the game of football, but you just seem to take it to another level. You loved calling games when Brett Favre was quarterback. I love calling games with anybody. I mean, you know, I, <laughs> Sunday it might be Joe Callahan. I mean, yeah, I love calling games with anybody, but Brett made it fun mm -hmm. uh, because there's a couple things about him. Number one, when you walked out of the tunnel, with Brett Favre, or you were up in the booth following the team with Brett Favre walking out of the tunnel, you knew you had a chance. He was the type of player that gave everybody hope. And because of his talents, it was always a realistic hope.